In Black Ops 3, the VMP is already overpowered, but today we're gonna teach you how to make the VMP overpowered even more. So without further ado, let's get into this. Listen. Welcome, mates. I'm Bloodthirsty Lord, where you can be Lordy and today in Black Ops 3, I'm going to teach you how to make the VMP even more overpowered with a few simple steps. The gameplay that is running in the background is just two gameplays smashed together, or multiple gameplays just smashed together, showing the highlights I had while using the VMP. And guys, know this is one of the best SMGs, or even one of the best guns at the moment in Black Ops 3. It's used in competitive play, pubs, anything. Even GBs, it's one strong weapon right now. The reason why it's so strong, it's because of the weapon balancing that happened like a week or two ago, once the new updates came out for the new weapons and stuff, they also did a weapon balancing update, and this is the effect of it, and that's why the VMP has got such a high tier spot for the SMGs and guns in general within Black Ops 3. We're going to teach you how to make this gun even more overpowered by providing you one of the most legendary classes that I've ever created, and we're also going to talk about how to use the VMP in different situations. So let's move on to the class setup. Indeed, the VMP will be your primary weapon. Also, you will have three attachments, so you want to activate the wild card, primary gunfighter one, and that will give you your third attachment. The three attachments we're going to have within this class are the long barrel, quick draw, and grip. We have no secondaries, lethal grenades, or tactical grenades within this class. Before we get into our perks, you want to activate perk 2 greed as one of your wild cards, since we're going to have four perks in total, and our perk 1 will be flat jacket, perk 2 will be fast hands and scavenger, perk 3 will be tactile mask. So that is the class setup, 10 points used up, and all those points were used up in a useful way to give us a great advantage within the game. Why do I consider this to be one legendary class setup? It's because of the attachments that we have on our VMP and our perks. The VMP uh, attachments we had are long barrel, quick draw, and grip. We're able to kill enemies from close range, medium range, and even long range. It makes the gun just more useful in nearly every scenario. Then also having the perks flat jacket, will make us survive from explosives, trip mines, anything that gets really irritating in any team objective game mode when people chuck grenades quite a lot. Then also having fast hands, if you're running gunning around the map, you're able to pretty much aim quicker so your ADS is really low and you can kill the enemies right in front of you by having great accuracy. And also having scavenger, since this gun rips through ammo really quickly, it has like a 40 magazine per clip, which is pretty good. And problem is, it runs out really quickly. So by having scavenger, you're able to pick up more ammo on the way and keep those kill streaks and score streaks going. Then we have tactical mask. One thing I hate is shock charges with trip mines. So flat jacket and tactical mask at the same time will stop that little combination from killing us. And also, if we have a one v one and people are chucking nades at us and also tactical grenades at us, we can stop that and slow down the effect by like 50%. So that makes us more useful in a 1v1 scenario. So this is one scenario that could occur with one of your games. So if you have three opponents coming towards you, one that is close range, one that is medium range, or one that is long range, you can potentially spray down the close to medium range characters very easily, or the enemies in this case. But the third character that's, or the third enemy that is in the distance, pretty much long distance, you want to try your best to shoot a couple of bullets at a time. You didn't want to spray, and if you're already out of ammo since of your spraying that you did to the first two enemies, you want to reload and take cover for a bit until the other enemy gets closer, or you can try and go for those little sneaky shots when you're head glitching to finish up for that clean triple kill. May this is the key to success. If you run this class, you'll be able to win any game very easily, and you're guaranteed easy kills and easy score streaks, kill streaks, whatever you want, this class will make you do it. Another one of these classes will be out very soon because I love this overpower series that we're starting on in the channel. You guys enjoy it quite a lot by the Vespa that we did last time. A link to that on the annotation on screen right now or check the description below. But guys, if you enjoy these videos and you want to see more, leave a comment down below saying that and also what gun do you want to see next and what do you think about this class setup right here? So mates, if you enjoyed this video, show your support by smashing the blue like button. Let's try to get 20 likes on this video. And if you guys want to see more Black Ops 3 content on this channel, all you have to do is share this with a friend and hit that subscribe button to become a mate today. And that is all for this video. Oh, time to go, but don't you worry. We're back very soon. Hang out, boys. Two things have nothing yet. Just